So hi hello everyone hope you all are good today we are going to be discuss about the mastering of the layer technique which is called completely with it in this haircut we are elevating over all the layers and uh, we are not giving any sims the haircut is something it will be elevating more overall compared to the previous of haircuts and just very simple section i am just going to be taking First harsh view, the octu print section got separated and just stop motion it will be going to be separated and uh, another section is just going to be separating because I want to give something add more layers in the crown portions to be compared to the sides why because uh, the side portions I want to save the length I can just I want to show more of them instead of to the sides I want to show more in the bounciness in the top portion even my client required to not require too much of the lens so that is a consider I'm just changing up to the haircut techniques in this haircuts and previous videos also you got to know about how these techniques and ideas are going to be implemented and just going to be given to the good scales of the haircuts and developments in the haircuts and a lot of things are got changed for in this haircut we are just going to be seeing something similar up to the elevation and you can just some explaining help up to the comb techniques also you can just see in that and just take very little bit trimming up to the bottom just one length in the bottom and rest of the hairs are starting to the layers very soon and in this haircut elevating with only bulky layers not to be cutting too much up to the length why because the previous haircut was the three months ago she got it done with me so the next haircut she wants something refresh on the same existing length and apart from that add some more layers so that is a very few lengths and just going to be cut with a one length after the basic haircut so top of that i want to create more layers which can be make something multiple things to be carry forward and it will be look so bouncy just exactly i pick from the center profile and just exactly elevating bulky layers and this is going to be cut so i'm taking to the exactly 120 degree and rest of the bulky layers I'm just going to be cut it's simply elevating to over all the layers so I don't want to be cut too much of the layers compared to the previous haircuts because my client wants to be do want to be anything collapse in the length so that's a consider and just focusing on to the part from the length adding the layers Just taking very thin thin section and just adding the layers. I'm just cross checking. It's even. I'll come to another side and the same technique and just following in stationary guideline pick from previous haircut and just rest up here. So the bulky layers in the sense wherever you can just elevate it, rest up the existing layers can be shown extremely it will be access up to the layers that is called the bulky layers according to the when we elevating too much of layering techniques and just uh, lifting and elevations there you can just see and the bulkiness on the hair then you can just reduce it and just cross checking up to that and just overall the clear and I'll come to the side portion Side portion and just before start, I just give into the one time basic haircut and just checking overall both of them. Now I start to the layering. I come to another side I take from the stationary guideline from back and rest up the hair adding the leaves So hope you guys all are understand very clearly in this haircuts it will be elevating it's not to be going to collapse anything length 
apart from the land it will be based on the lens which is going to be add and just creating to the layers which can be carry forward something pretty as good things and all and a haircut and the concave and convex layer is something is different and this haircut will be elevating so that should be something a little more different on the other haircuts so now i come to reuse the crown section and just going to be giving to the o direction layer and i'll show you exactly i'm picking with the center of the crown and the rest of the hair i'm going to create the layer So one more section I just do, adding to the layers. And I'll just take to another side section. And same technique I'm just going to follow. just cross checking and now just come to the fringe portion and just taking this triangle shape to the hair fringes and just going to over directing with the right to left and adding the layer I'm just going to be start with the before blow down just giving it a good serum to the heat protection and top of that I'm just showing to my before styling to my client and just showing the beachy wave this pickles and she was excited to be see the such a look and I was just we're going to do a styling on top of that so finally we giving back to something blow dry let's see blow dry before do the styling i'm just showing with my client something it's messy look now on top of that i'm just going to be start with a blow dry just giving exactly with a spiral blow dry overall and just one more section i pick with exactly same thing i follow and again Now I come to it on the side. Finish with a completely giving me light and just inwards blow rides overall to make something finishing of it. And overall, it looks so something flexible and finishing look, and it makes so volumetric and clean and long finishing also. It is so visible like something. a gloss finish now i come to crown portion to adding extra volume on the top portion
Now I'm finishing it over all the blue dry section. The crown portion is going to be released. Now I can just see if something is more bouncy in this. And how shiny and visible on the layers. So this is the final finishing which can be give something more a creativity and just small section it will be changed with entire haircuts. So this is the things I would expect something it will be different on the every time and every haircut on it. And also you see something very clearly and just glossy finishing on the layers. So now we're just going to be add the texture. And this before texture my client was very much happy and just and it's very much satisfied too. I'm just adding some texture overall and I'm finishing it. So this is a things which you can just finish in to give it overall the hair carpet completely to make clean and neat look and professional th ethical work. And if you like my video please hit the like button and do share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It's overall cut will be finished and you can just see the come something like more bouncier and flexible look from the back portion. And you can just see so much of the layers when I just picked up with as a ponytail. So this is my final finishing. And if you like the video, please hit the like button and do share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. We'll be meet up to the next video. Until take care.